Welcome to our first ever OpenAI Dev Day. Today, we are launching a new model, GPT-4 Turbo. GPT-4 supported up to 8K, and in some cases, up to 32K context length. But we know that isn't enough for many of you and what you want to do. GPT-4 Turbo supports up to 128,000 tokens of context. We're also updating the knowledge cutoff. We are just as annoyed as all of you, probably more, that GPT-4's knowledge about the world ended in 2021. We will try to never let it get that out of date again. GPT-4 Turbo has knowledge about the world up to April of 2023, and we will continue to improve that over time. And with our new text-to-speech model, you'll be able to generate incredibly naturally, natural sounding audio from text in the API with six preset voices to choose from. I'll play an example. Did you know that Alexander Graham Bell, the eminent inventor, was enchanted by the world of sounds? So today we're launching a new program called Custom Models. With Custom Models, our researchers will work closely with a company to help them make a great custom model, especially for them and their use case using our tools. We're doubling the tokens per minute for all of our established GPT-4 customers so that it's easier to do more. And you'll be able to request changes to further rate limits and quotas directly in your API account settings. So we're introducing Copyright Shield. Copyright Shield means that we will step in and defend our customers and pay the costs incurred if you face legal claims around copyright infringement. And this applies both to ChatGPT Enterprise and the API. I'm super excited to announce that we worked really hard on this. And GPT-4 Turbo, a better model, is considerably cheaper than GPT-4. By a factor of 3x for prompt tokens and 2x for completion tokens starting today. GPTs are tailored versions of ChatGPT for a specific purpose. You can build a GPT, a customized version of ChatGPT, for almost anything, with instructions, expanded knowledge, and actions. And then you can publish it for others to use. We're going to launch the GPT store. You can list a GPT there, and we'll be able to feature the best and the most popular GPTs. Of course, we'll make sure that GPTs in the store follow our policies before they're accessible. 